these messages were racially charged. They were extremely offensive and certainly nothing to repeat. They were so shocking to one parent that I spoke to today that she actually kept her daughter home from school and tells me she doesn't plan to send her back until the situation has been addressed. It says greetings from Magnolia School District. We hate the N-word and black students. Um, if they come to school, they will be expelled. And it also said uh, blacks and Jews. Magnolia ISD said in a statement that the hack happened yesterday afternoon. It affected the district's communication system, which includes their social media, text messages, emails, and phone. Then last night, some parents and students received messages threatening the safety of some in the district, specifically Magnolia High School. They did send an email to parents letting them know that the district had been hacked, while the Montgomery County Precinct 5 Constable's Office launched an investigation. They told me today they found the threats made in the correspondence were not credible and students were able to return to school today. But as Magnolia ISD parent Cynthia Jackson looked into what happened more, she didn't feel like the district properly addressed what happened with the students and told them that that behavior and prejudice would not be tolerated. This is the new day and age. We shouldn't be having all of this. I didn't go to school uh, where I had to have this problem and I don't want my child to go to school and have to have this problem to where she can't go to school and feel like she's safe. Precinct 5 just told me they are working with Magnolia ISD's IT department to get as much information about the hack as they can so they can locate who's behind it.